Alrighty guys, welcome back to another episode of the Arcanine Draft League. Today we will be facing off against Cody and the Vancouver Victinis. Cody's team has a lot of really strong Pokemon, uh, including, but not limited to, Incineroar, Kartana, Blastoise, Latios, Togetic, like lots of strong Pokemon, so we're up with quite a challenge. If I recall correctly, Cody is also undefeated right now, so... Yeah, kind of nervous. Oh, crap. My bad. Oh, okay, I am right. I'm not crazy. Sorry, Focus Sash and Expert Belt looked pretty similar in the menu. All right, good luck, Cody. Uh, you need that luck, too. All right, let's see. Papagrigus, yeah. Nido King are about the only two Pokemon that I don't want to use. Papagrigus is very physically demanding. Nido King. Yeah. All right. Let's roll with that. And see how well that works. Goemon, I'm not sure about was Gardevoir. See if that comes back to bite us. Cody is a really strong player, so hopefully we won't get destroyed too badly. American Dead Knight. Okay, dude. Alright. Alright. Fine. I see how we're gonna be. Into an ED immediately disable fake out that I expect. Alphagrigus is an issue here. A shadow ball. But it's very physically defensive, not special. So maybe we can Oko it, but I kind of doubt it. I'm not sure that we are going to get the Yoko here. It might have been better to KO the Incineroar. Oh, is he Dynamaxing Cofagrigus? Really? I doubt he does. In oh! Yeah, we were probably better going off on the Incineroar. Huh. Probably better Scalding Incineroar right out the gate. Well, the good news is we lowered his attack, so maybe he can't one-hit KO us with the Mac Dark Max Darkness. Oh yeah, we're good. As long as Shadow Ball can't KO us, I think we're fine.
Oh, trick room. Sneaky, sneaky. Okay. For uh, those of you who do not know, Nightmare was my signature Gyarados from the Nidoqueen Draft League. That is what Cody is referencing. Body press. Nothing. And was a crit. Max Darkness, on the other hand. Yeah, that does a bit more. Blast and Oh, that did nothing. Oh, that did nothing. Alright. Intimidate again. We need that thing dead. Two attacked up drops, I think we're good. We have one turn next to use that trick room. Oh! Yeah, those special defense drops. Yep, that makes sense. Oh, good job, Torcat. Come on. Like, I knew we were going to have a rough battle, but I did not think it was going to be this rough. Forgot a choice scarfed Torcat. Forgot to take off the Evia light. That makes sense. I was wondering how a two minus two Incineroar handled Torcat as well as it was. That makes sense now. Now it's minus three Incineroar. Psychic terrain ought to be ending relatively soon. Fine. Aww. Would have been cool if Torcat had lived. That's fine. We mostly did that to get the special defense off. Although I definitely was hoping that would KO. Dang. Recruitment. Gotta be this turn, right? Yeah. I think we are officially dead. Could have one. Could have protect on you, maybe. You lived. Just maybe.
But it's not over till the fat lady sings. But I think it's over. Still probably got Cartana in the back. I kind of expect Blastoise. Both of those just need one hit off. KO. Oh, Needle King. Okay. I'm locked into this move anyways. I don't really get a choice. GG, Cody. Yep. Game over. All right. Well, there's an end to our losing or to our winning streak. Up next, we have, and not to be mistaken with Cody, but Cody, uh, also known as the Savior Cody. I will post a link to his YouTube channel in the next video. I hope to see you guys then. Have a great one.